Michigan's got one on and one out, but the ball game has no score, no more. Jordan Brewer drives it to right and Jesse Franklin scores. This means the Mason Blue have scored in the first inning of every game of the College World Series, and Blake Nelson made sure two batters later, they're not done. Well, and this is what's been so impressive. One through nine, Blake Le Nelson does a great job. A pitch he can handle, not doing too much, making sure that run comes home. Two zip Michigan in the first. Next inning, they got two on again. A KO Thomas rips it to left for a double. Jack Blomgren comes in to score. Well, and you know what? You've got to use the whole field. We saw Jesse Franklin down the right field line, and now Mr. Thomas down the left field line. Jimmy Kerr leads the world in homers in the College World Series. This was his third in the College World Series. And I tell you what, fastball first strike, he was late on. Fastball first strike, he was late on. He was not late for that curveball. Kerr's family loving it. Michigan's doubling up. Vandy, 6-3. to three. Top of the eighth now, Joe Donovan. Nobody on, nobody out. Insurance. And this is what good teams do. You said it. Insurance. You keep adding on. Whether it's run one, one run or two runs, if you can keep adding on, the momentum stays on your side. Now, in the eighth inning, Tommy Henry is still in there. And look who's up. It's J.J. Blade with the swing and a miss. Michigan single season record holder for K's is rolling. Next batter, Ethan Paul. Hits it to right, but Jordan Brewer in right field has a cannon. And I tell you what, whoever put that scattering report together needs to go back and say to those Vanderbilt hitters, don't run on the guy in right field. He's the Big Ten Player of the Year for a reason. Great tag, by the way, as well. An amazing blue bench, loving it. Next batter, Henry, facing Philip Clark. No need for the bat. Strike three looking. The inning is done for Michigan. The ball game is done for Michigan. They get the win seven to four and are now one victory away from being national champions in baseball. They had 14 hits against a 57-win Vanderbilt squad, and every single player that started in this lineup got themselves a hit.